Uh, well, with Josh Casey, working, working skipper, and it's been a long journey coming out the wrong end of the scoreline. But uh, Josh, we've heard from Michael, we've heard from the gaffer. In turn, speaking as a player, speaking as a skipper, how did you see that game? Yeah, a difficult one, really. I thought we, we started the game positively. We were on the front foot, how we wanted to start the game, and then we sort of give away a, a freak goal and, and then another freak goal, and, and we give ourselves a, a mountain to climb then. I think from from then on we, we dominated, especially second half, created a lot of chances. Obviously they had their moments on the counter, which they're going to have when we start committing more people forward. But I thought on the balance of play we, we definitely deserve something from the game. We created a lot of chances um, and, and probably did enough to, to nick at least a point, in, in my opinion. Yeah, I'd, I, I, you know, I'd agree with that. There were a lot of chances pushing at the end. The fans were great and keeping behind, keeping behind the scene. Yeah, I think that's that's definitely something that we, we wanted to mention as players. Just a, a big thank you to the fans that, that did travel and then clapping us off at the at the end after a defeat. You know, it would be easy not to. It would be easy not to travel. It would be easy to to not clap us off. But but we really do appreciate that. Hopefully, they can see on the pitch that the endeavour that's there and we are given everything. And and hopefully, we'll, we'll start to repay some of that faith that they've shown in us all season and then and start climbing the table soon. And you're obviously now a very experienced player, very experienced captain. You've seen all sorts of situations, I suppose, uh, almost everything that could happen on a football field. So what, what's your take on what, what is important in the coming weeks? Results, I think. Results, um, that's, that's what we need. It's a, it's a cliche, but points, is, points mean everything at this stage. Obviously, we've got none today, and that's when you start to, to look at other things that you can, you can hopefully take from the game. Every defeat burns us and hurts us. And, I think there are defeats where you so come away with no points and you can't take anything from it, but there are positives that, that we can take and we now have to move on straight into Tuesday and, and go and try and back up a performance with a result and get points because that, that is what means everything at this stage. And one thing that's for sure is there'll be lots of twists and turns between now and the end of the season and I know it's a cliche that every, day, every game stands in its own right, but moving on to Tuesday, I'm sure there'll be a good number at Ebsley and uh, getting behind you and the boys. Yeah, I really, I really hope so. Like I say, it was, it was great the, the support that we that we had today. Really disappointed that we couldn't return with something and and get at least a point because I think that's that is what we des- what we deserve. We threw everything we could at them in a tricky conditions, really horrible, horrible pitch. We we did give absolutely everything, and I think on on another day the ball drops you differently. Maybe you convert one of those chances, and we could have even come away with three rather than rather than none. But we are where we are, and we need to make sure we put away any, any disappointment and any um, frustrations that we have from today and take it into Tuesday because the most important thing now is the next match. Thanks for your time, Josh. Safe trip home and hard luck today, but we'll see you on Tuesday. Thanks, Thanks very much. See you Tuesday.